What's up guys? In this video, we are going to be taking these two end saber NeoPixel lightsabers and we are going to test how durable they are for dueling. Okay? Uh, this lightsaber here is my Mandalorian themed lightsaber by end sabers that I do have a video of this a full video of this on my channel if you guys want to go check that out. You can see the full video of this lightsaber and all its features and stuff. And this is my new Revan lightsaber that End Sabers sent me. Hold on, I'm gonna put this other lightsaber down quick. And this is probably like one of my best looking lightsabers I've ever received. Uh, it came with this grip tape here, which I absolutely love on lightsabers but uh, I'll just show you guys what it all comes with in the box. All right, here's the nice end sabers box. Comes with white gloves, comes with the manual, the display stand, tool kit. Inside the tool kit, blade plug. Oh, nice grip tape, which I like grip tape on my lightsabers. And here's the end sabers plaque that goes with the display stand. USB-C charger with Allen key and set screws in there. And here is the blade and the Revan hilt. All right, so you do have to untwist and pull apart the hilt to access the charging port here. I know some of you have preferences on where you like your charging ports. I personally like mine on the inside of the hilt. I know some of you guys like to have ease of access to the charging port on the outside, but I'm gonna go ahead and get this charged up now and then I'll show you the rest of the features. Okay, now that we're all charged up, I wanna show you guys something really, really cool about this lightsaber quick before we get started with the uh, dueling test is that this lightsaber has end sabers newest SNV4 Pro chip. And what the SNV4 Pro chip does is it allows me to connect this lightsaber using Bluetooth. This is an aluminum hilt. Uh, it's got four set screws, two on this side and two on this side. So it'll be really strong for testing it out for dueling. A 32 inch polycarbonate NeoPixel blade. And how you connect the SNV4 Pro chip to Bluetooth is you download the app. I'll leave all of this information in the description box below. Everything you need to know will be in the description box below. Okay, you download the Force Park V2 app and here's where you turn on the lightsaber. This button right here, this first button, this top button. Uh, this button will actually change modes, but you won't need to use this button if you download the app and use the app to change your lightsaber settings. So you turn, you power on the lightsaber. Power oh, on. Oh. And this speaker is honestly like the loudest speaker that I have in any of my lightsabers. And it's like obvious, this lightsaber is really loud. Open the Force Park V2 app. Connected. And you hear that it says it's connected, right? And for, actually I'm gonna turn off the lights uh, so you can see all the features of this lightsaber quick. Okay, now that the lights are off, I'm going to power on the lightsaber using the app. This speaker is so loud. And you can hear that it does have smooth swing. That's Blaster, as you can see on the app. Lock it. You can control all this from the app. It's so cool. Blade color. You can also switch the sound font. <laughs> Sidious or Emperor Palpatine. The 
this app is so cool. Uh, for someone like me, I'm, I get kind of impatient, I guess, uh, when I have to like cycle through uh, the sound fonts and colors by like, you know, pressing the buttons, like going through the manual and everything. And this app here just makes it, so, this app just makes it so easy. Ray Skywalker. <laughs> Kylo Ren. Here's a Soka. Here's all the different like sound fonts that you can actually um, preview. See, here's the preview of it, just the sound. And there's just blade effects here. You can preview them. Here's a classic rainbow. This is just the effect without the sound, and you can like mix and match uh, every anything with this app. All right, you guys get the idea, right? Uh, all the information that you need for this will be in the description box below, and I'll just let you guys go through all the stuff once you, you know, get a hold of this app. Okay, on to the test. You guys ready? <laughs> oh man, NeoPixel versus NeoPixel. Green is a Mandalorian-themed lightsaber. And the red is Revan's lightsaber, which, if you guys don't know who Darth Revan or Revan is, he was, you know, both Sith and Jedi. Um, I would look him up. He's like one of the coolest characters in all of Star Wars. But here goes the test, okay? Wow, that's actually really cool. <laughs> um, I made sure the set screws are really tight. I mean, come on. Are you gonna hit your friends that hard? Really? <laughs> to fly off in my apartment. That's interesting. Something must be shocking this, like the hilt. The hilt's probably being shocked to turn off. Like that's triggering, triggering some sort of turn off. You guys know what we should do. All right, you guys know what time it is. Remember, you can use code HALION at Endsabers to save yourself 7% off your entire order. The link will be in the description box below. Right now what I'm doing is I'm making sure the set screws are really tight so the blade doesn't fly off. And yes, this test is 100% necessary. It's getting these real tight. And I hope no one calls the cops because it's in the middle of the night and there's houses nearby and this is probably going to be loud. And Sabers, I'm sorry if you're watching this, but this is your uh, Mandalorian themed Neo Pixel versus a metal pole. <laughs> oh, I think I broke it. Yep, I think I broke it. You can see right there where uh, the LEDs right here are still working, but I think I broke some sort of connection from here 
to the rest of the blade. Like, the hilt still works. You know what? Okay, hang on. I'm gonna go take the other blade from the Riven lightsaber and put it in this hilt, because they're both one inch in diameter. So, yeah, let's go back to my apartment and check that out. Wow, this is really cool. What'd you guys think? Pretty crazy, right? <laughs> Power off. All right, let's check this out. Maybe I'll turn this light off. So you can kind of see. All right. This is the this is the same blade. I just pushed it down more. Oh wow. This is the ribbon blade. I did not switch it, okay? Re sorry, Revan. Oh, oh. Look, it works. That's crazy. It must have like detected that the blade wasn't on there anymore. Guys, I'm actually shocked. I hit that so hard, it actually, like, the shock from hitting that, uh, like, hurt my hand after that when I was, like, driving back. That is wild! I thought I broke it. But really what it was, was, um, just the light from the from the hilt itself that was shining to the bottom of the blade, like this. See, the pins? Oh, I probably can't see because I don't have that light on. Yeah, see, you can see the, the pins right here. That is crazy. So it was basically just doing this when we saw it earlier, right? But really, it, it just came loose like that. Wow! <laughs> that is so cool. It works, it didn't break. And you guys saw how hard I swung this. <laughs> this is amazing. Guys, check out N Sabers, okay? You can use code HALION to save 7% off your entire order. Thank you, Sabers, for sending me these solid crafted and beautiful lightsabers. This is so awesome, guys. <laughs> you know, I was gonna take apart the blade if it was broken and like, so we can see the inside of it and stuff, but hey, it works. I'm happy. Hopefully you guys are happy. Uh, thank you guys very much for watching the video. May the force be with you. I'll see you soon. I can't believe it. I can't believe it.